Hi guys, it's Maria and welcome to my YouTube channel. I literally have been wanting to start a channel and make videos for what feels like years now and I just kept putting it off. And finally, I'm like, you know what, let's just take the plunge and do it. I have nothing to lose. I have such a passion for all things YouTube, fashion, lifestyle, makeup, anything like that is totally down my alley. So let's get right into it with a collective haul. I have pieces here from Lisa Goslin, Skims, Abercrombie, Aritzia, Essence, all the good things I'm really excited to share. Starting with Lisa Goslin. This is the first time that I've actually tried anything from her website and I'm wearing the pieces right now so I can show you guys. So these are the Lisa Goslin E007 hoops and then they're little everyday bold hoops as well, which I love. I feel like they're the perfect size for everyday wear, um, which is great. They came in these cute little dust bags with the little initials LG. Really good quality, really affordable pieces. Uh, Lisa Galson is based out of downtown Toronto, which is really nice because the prices are in Canadian. So you're not surprised with any extra fees or duties when you receive your jewelry. I'm loving these pieces. I'll come up closer so you guys can see them. The little diamond ones are so cute. I just feel like it adds a little sparkle to your everyday stock. Next up from Essence, I picked up, I haven't tried this brand before, but Laura Lombardi is the name of the brand. Oh, they're cute. So... I wanted a pair that's a little bit thicker. Um, I have a few pairs from Missouri and Adina's jewels, but they're just not as thick as I would like them. Um, they were on clearance on Essence. They are brass, which is nice. So that's those. I will have them linked down below. Okay, so up next, let's get into Skims. I have purchased some of her undergarments before, which I did like. Um, the only thing I will say is that they did fit a little bit tighter. So next time I would just size up one just because I don't like my underwear and bras to feel like I'm spilling out everywhere. So I just would opt for a bigger size next time. But I decided to try some items from her actual um, clothing collection. So I picked up a lot of basics. Very much a basics girl. I love anything neutral, plain, white tees, black tees, grit. Like just very plain and basic. I live off my basics. So I really try and invest in good pieces. A lot of my basics are from Aritzia and I can always do a video on that if you guys want to see. I really wanted to try some of her jersey line specifically because the fabric just looks absolutely amazing and I've heard that it literally feels like butter. So I picked up three colors in the jersey mock neck tank. This is the high neck one and when I tell you this material is so stretchy, so comfortable, I picked it up in my true size medium and it fits like a glove. It's perfect. So I got black and then I also picked up this cream off white color, which is nice. I just love all of these for layering. I think they're perfect for that. So same exact style. And then the last one I picked up is a nice little pop of color, kind of blue, graphite blue color, um, which I really like. I kind of want to do like an all blue moment. So I thought that was cute. And then from Skims, I also picked up, this is literally tiny, but it's really cute. So this is the Fits Everybody Super Cropped t-shirt. I know it looks super short because it is, but again, it's that super stretchy, nice fabric. Got it in a medium. It will be super cropped, but that's the vibe I was kind of going for. So, and then lastly from Skims, I got two basic long sleeves. The first one is the Jersey Mock Neck long sleeve um, in that same fabric size medium and then this is in that same off-white color I just think this is such a nice fitting elevated basic like this would just be so easy to throw on so I got that color and then I also picked up the same shirt in this gray color which I'm super excited about so that is everything I picked up from Skims all right so next up is Aritzia which I'm very excited about if you know me, you know that I'm an avid Aritzia shopper and I have been for years. I actually used to work at Aritzia, um, which was a great experience for me. Definitely got me out of my comfort zone, but just a little background. Um, so let's get into what I got. So the first thing I picked up, more basics. I know you guys are probably gonna think it's like the same thing over and over again, but I'm telling you they're like all I wear. So really to me, it's money well spent. First thing I picked up is this little TNA ribbed long sleeve this is their new material i have the one that's like the cropped ribbed kind of more structured this one's way more stretchy which i prefer i think it fits way nicer so i picked this up in a size medium 
And then that same shirt I picked up in gray because when I like something, I buy in every color. So this is in the color Heather Chrome. I get in a size medium. And the star of the Aritzia show. These are the effortless pant in the color Cognac, which is this beautiful brown color. So I already own the effortless pant in black, white, and then charcoal gray. So I think the brown is a really nice addition. I love the fit of these pants. They're the perfect baggy oversized dress pant that just make you look so chic and put together. I got mine in a size 10, which is typically my true size. I go between a size 8 or a 10, but with dress pants, I like to go a little bit bigger because they're more structured and I like to be comfy all the time. So I thought these were so cute. Like I'm excited to literally just wear these with my little skims tops, like the little off-white one. How cute is that? Anyways, so yeah, I'm very excited about these pants. And that is everything from Aritzia. So moving on to Abercrombie who, by the way, is making a huge comeback and I love all of their jeans. They're like all I wanna wear now, they're amazing. I picked up another basic long sleeve. This is a white one and it's ribbed. There was actually a glitch last week um, where it was a 20% off discount in your bag and then you could stack another 20% on top of it. So I got 40% off my whole order, which is really good. Just a basic long sleeve ribbed t-shirt in a size medium and it's very stretchy and just a good length. I have trouble sometimes with long sleeves actually fitting my arm all the way because I have long arms. So yeah, love that. I picked up this amazing, huge, chunky gray knit cardigan. Um, I got this in an XL because I want it to be super, super oversized and big. I thought this layered on top of that little blue skims tank with blue jeans and sneakers is such a simple, cute outfit. So and I love the pockets on there. Like they're actually nice, deep functioning pockets. And I love the little cable knit detail on the sleeves. I'm all about comfort, but I like to do it in a nice chic put together way. Obviously I'm very much a sweat set girl, but sometimes when I want to look a little bit more elevated, I love a nice ribbed lounge pant and they have a nice like V in the front, which is really flattering. So these are the ribbed wide leg knit pants this i guess cream beige color and i got mine in the size medium but yeah they're just like this elasticated waistband long cream pant these are key in my wardrobe next up i picked up something very similar but these ones aren't so wide leg they're more straight leg i believe they're called the 90s straight leg knit pants these are thinner and the ribbing is way wider. The other ones are thicker and like a thinner ribbing material. But yeah, these are more straight leg. And I love that Abercrombie has short, regular, and long pant lengths because tall girls and short girls know that it's very hard to find pants that actually look good and give you that look that you want without looking way too long or way too short in my case. So love these. I got these in a medium long. And again, just the same kind of vibe can make it look dressed up and fancy but still be super comfy so i love those all right so next up i picked up this little quarter zip top i usually don't reach for something like this with a pattern but because it is a neutral pattern and everything in my closet is so basic and plain i wanted to add just like a little pop when i feel like wearing something different on top like when i just don't want to be so plain it's tight ribs thick you don't need to wear a bra with it i just think it's very 90s with like a slick back bun oversized baggy jeans, throw this little tight top on, sneakers, booties, and you're good. So I got this in a size medium and yeah, it's super cute. Last but not least, I picked up a pair of the Curve Love Dad high rise jeans. I'm actually wearing a version of these right now in light wash and I'm obsessed with them. And because they're a dad jean, they are looser, which is perfect. I've been looking for a pair of jeans like this forever. So when I found them, I had to get them in black because you just need a good pair of black jeans. So I picked these up in a size 30. They have the little crisscross detail, which is nice. And they kind of dip in the front. They're super high-waisted and they go so long. And I just love them. I can't wait to style these. And they're just like a comfortable jean, which is very hard to come by. So love these. And again, I will have them linked down below for you if you're interested. All right, guys. So that is everything for the haul today. I hope you guys enjoyed my first YouTube video. 
I love shopping and doing hauls, so I'm sure I will be back very soon with another haul. Any other suggestions that you have, just leave down below for me, and I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Thank you.